It is Sunday and we are having chili dogs. I have chili, sauerkraut, mustard on mine with hot spicy pickles. And this is lunch. Okay, it is Monday. Monday, Monday. Okay, you guys don't want to hear that. Anyways, we're having scrambled eggs and toast that my husband made. He was a big sweetheart this morning. And he even made the coffee. But he didn't bring home the bacon. <laughs> All right, we're going to have eggs. I'll see you guys at lunch, maybe. Okay, here's the spaghetti. And we are going to eat, and I've got my water to drink. Tuesday, I forgot to film this, and I'm just now cleaning out my blender, but we had green smoothies for breakfast. Um, I just, whenever I get done and everybody's had theirs, I just put soap and hot scalding water, and then I just turn it on and let it soap up, soap up, soap up, and then it's clean. So that's what we had today was green smoothies. See you guys around lunchtime. It is lunchtime. We have our... Um, French fries, and we have our hamburgers, and I've got pepper jack cheese on it. And we're getting ready to eat. For snack tonight, I made everybody some oatmeal raisin cookies. And it's dark outside, so that's why the lighting isn't real good for you guys to see the cookies, but that is what we had, and they are delicious. Good morning. It is Wednesday and I'm having some wheat toast with butter for breakfast. Um, what you're hearing in the background is my washing machine and dryer running. And I'm starting my day off by actually painting and doing some crafts. Um, everybody else is still in the bed. Um, realizing today that my coffee pot is going to have to be um, replaced because here lately it has been brewing three-fourths of the way and then turning off automatically and then you have to turn it back on so that it brews the rest of the way so um, we've had it um, come from William Sonoma and we probably had that coffee pot about six years so we got a good good time out of it um, so we're gonna have to purchase a new one here soon um, especially before winter because I cannot deal without my um, coffee <laughs> in the winter time at decaf or otherwise because I'm so bitter cold all the time so I am just starting my day I hope y'all are having a wonderful Wednesday morning well it won't be Wednesday morning when you see this whatever time it is I hope it's wonderful and I will be checking in with you uh, guys later um, Dinner is probably going to be, I don't know, I'm really uncertain about dinner. Um, I have a whole chicken that is thawed, and I think I'm definitely going to put it in the crock pot uh, for dinner. But I also have some fish, and I was supposed to fix it last night, but when we had the burgers, and I kept saying it was lunch, <laughs> um, I had no idea how late it was and so um, that ended up being our dinner and then last night Lucas and I made some oatmeal raisin cookies um, for a treat um, and so today um, I may make the fish and the chicken because I only have four fillets so I figure um, one of us will just eat the chicken and not have the fish um, I have some potatoes left and it is getting down to the nitty-gritty I think Saturday I'm gonna run and do my monthly Costco haul um, so you all will see that video coming up soon probably sometime next week um, so we have that going on because we are hitting the bottom of the barrel guys for um, food so let me get my toast ate, and I will see you probably at dinner time. Uh, we have some meetings and some things to, today to take care of, so I'm not sure uh, what lunch will look like. 
but I'm just going to go ahead and eat my breakfast. See you later, guys. It is Wednesday night, dinner time. I just took my chicken. Of course, when I take the chicken out, it just falls all apart because it's so tender. Um, just took it out of the crock pot right there. And just a little tip for some of you that might not know this, but if you're only going to cook just a chicken by itself um, in the crock pot so it doesn't sit in its own grease and get the bottom of your chicken all soggy, ball up some uh, pieces of foil and sit up underneath the chicken so it's not sitting directly on the bottom of the um, crock pot. So just a little tip just in case you guys don't know you can do that. Uh oh, this is a cooker's disaster going on here. I'm just talking away and blah. <laughs> it's fine though. It's just white rice in here and I am bringing it to a boil and then what I do is I just put a plate on top and set the timer for 15 minutes and I come back and I have perfect rice and in there I just have some canned peas and some whole kernel corn Thursday dinner and we are having uh, tacos I ran to the grocery store last night and just bought a couple things to try to get through the week um, and so we had the new stand-up taco shells and um, we have some mild uh, cheddar cheese and some salsa and some sour cream and we have the lettuce over there chopped up so we just kind of make our own and eat and the boys are welcome to eat uh, I think there's enough in here for us to have uh, two a piece, I think, maybe more. But anyways, I'm not eating more than two. But that is what's for dinner. And the taco meat is made with ground turkey. It is Saturday, and for lunch, we are having a supreme pizza from Costco. We ate at the store, and then we brought the rest home for whoever didn't go shopping with us so they can have. And that is what we had for lunch.